Hey everybody, welcome back to another Disney and Pixar Guys diecast video on the Anchor Fires channel. And today, I'll be taking a look at the one and the only Mator with oil cans. I am so stoked to be finally getting a review on this guy. I've wanted this diecast for so many years now. And the only ones I've ever really had were the Disney Store version and the Mini Racers version. And now I have the basically final metal die cast release being the official 1 to 55 scale one very very awesome as you guys can see Mator right there he looks phenomenal he is one of the many few cars tunes ufm die cast alongside dr afschleffwagen mater also alongside corporal kim and um captain mjolnir or Munir, something like that. He's the army helicopter, but yeah, very, very happy to get this guy. Um, got him basically as a pretty much early Christmas gift from my grandparents. We went over to theirs as of the day of recording this video, and we got to open up all of our Christmas stuff. So, yeah, very, very cool. Now, yes, I know he is a very, very rare car, very expensive car, but. He's always been one of the ones I've really wanted for a long time. So I'm just going to go straight ahead, open this guy up, and I'll see you guys when that's done. All right, everyone. See, so here we have Mator right outside of the package. And this guy looks phenomenal. I can't even describe how awesome it feels to finally have this guy in my collection. He is just so amazing. Anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight into the review of this guy. So, Mator is a really, really nice looking die cast. So, let's just set him down over here. You guys can see he comes with a nice plastic little clear stand. This is so that you can display him, prop him up, and all that stuff. And then his little accessory is three of the big motor, uh, big leader motor, motor oil cans. So these are all really, really good looking. You can see it's three of them all connected into one piece, but kind of act as a little um, placement of them. So that's pretty cool. You got the two big ones up front, nice blue. Of course, these are all like little printed stickers on all of them. So they're all little plastic pieces, but it's got the one big, it's got the one big liter motor oil right there. Very, very nice cool little design for each of those then it's got the one down there tipping on the side as well as little printing on the very back which you actually probably can read but it's yeah you can see it's kind of hard to read but it definitely has a bunch of descriptions about what the oil is about or you know how companies have it sometimes but that's pretty much what it is so very cool but then we have Mator, and he does not disappoint. So you can see he's a very tiny little UFO diecast. Pretty cool. So he's got the same old UFO shape as a lot of UFOs are depicted to be. Basically rounded little shapes. Kind of like the eyepiece here is supposed to look like the little glass tube or glass area that the aliens would be in whatnot all stuff like that very very cool really big on that type of stuff too anyways you can see mate has the big beady eyes so just nice little black painted eyes with the white dots and basically the glare so that's very very good looking he's got a very pale blue yet sparkly paint job looks awesome you can even see it like a little ring light here glows on him or reflects off him very very nice he's also got all the, the little kind of patterns and inscriptions that the uh, metal sides of the ufo has so you can see they're all just like little patterns that go around in a circle very very nice and they're all indented so you can feel the grooves you can see the little indents on the sides there. Very, very nice looking. 
on the bottom. He's got his little mouth there, which you can see is two big buck teeth, just like Mater. Red mouth, bottom set of teeth. And yeah, it just looks really, really good on him. He's got his little date stamp code right there beneath the mouth. 194th day of 2010. Mattel Inc. All the other Mattel copyright stuff. And a nice little other um, extraterrestrial alien design on the bottom. Very, very cool. Look at all that. Nice little sink and um, symmetrical is what I was trying to say. Symmetrical design. Very, very nice looking. Overall, this guy is absolutely phenomenal. I was, you know, I really missed out on him back in the day. And I'm not even sure if he was available in the U.S. or not. Fairly certain that he was, but is he also got to be able to line it up correctly for the base there. In order for him to basically stand up. Yeah, so let's get him standing up. It sometimes it's a little hard, but you eventually will get it. And then also we can set up set him up with Dr. Abschlafwagen Mater, who is also a very good die cast. Oh, come on, Mater! Look at that—he rolled over and knocked him off. Ah, oh well. Anywho, that is going to do it for today's review of Mator the UFO with the oil cans. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Really hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a like on this review. See you guys in the next one. Peace.